The search is on for a new Roanoke City Police Chief after former Chief Chris Perkins retired earlier this year. Rather than hiring a recruiting firm to find a replacement, the city of Roanoke handling the job search and hiring process itself. WSLS 10's Aaron Brookshire talked to the city manager about this decision and some of the qualities he's looking for in the new chief. Aaron, good morning. Good morning. That's right. I know that city manager Chris Morrill is not taking this decision lightly. He knows how much people in Roanoke City care about who the police chief is, so he's really taking his time to find the best candidates for the job. Now, instead of using a national agency, the city is covering the hiring process, taking care of everything from posting the job online and in local newspapers. Morrill tells me cutting out the middleman gives city leaders a better chance to hear from the community on exactly what they want in a new police chief. And he he says with the former chief leaving the department in such a strong position, there's no rush to find a replacement. We can really spend some time to figure out what are the qualities we're looking for. So I've met with all the command uh, staff at the police department, got their input, talked to some neighborhood leaders, and so we're kind of building that profile as we go along. I need somebody who can come in and build off a successful department, which a different skill than if you have a department that's not functioning well, you want to hire a different kind of leader. I need somebody who can really build off and, and bring us to an either higher level than we are now. Some other major qualities include patrol experience in different types of neighborhood, like a mix of public housing, urban and suburban settings. Experience with mental health and its impact on crime is also important for this position.